If you're thinking about running sales in your e-learning site or just tired of the way that you've been running sales, this is the tutorial for you. Today, I'm going to demonstrate how to use the Sitewide Sales plugin with Lifter LMS and Paid Memberships Pro to put a discount on your entire course library and automatically apply the discount during a fixed window of time. We'll set a start and end date and a coupon code, and then we'll track all of our signups during the sale period. The sale will turn itself on and turn itself off on the dates that we say. Let's go. Okay, I'm starting with a website that is a demo site. I have all set up. It has Lifter LMS, it has their SkyPilot theme, and it has a basic Paid Memberships Pro installation. All of my courses are protected for a single all access membership level. I don't have any discount code set up and I haven't set up the sale yet. So let's get started doing that. The way this integration will work is when people purchase that all access level, they'll automatically get enrolled in the Lifter LMS courses that are attached to that membership level. So that's functionality in the PM Pro courses add-on. It's available for free in wordpress.org. Uh, so you can check that out. We'll put a link to it in the description below. So this is a demo site I created for an online school called Pro Therapy Institute. Thank you, ChatGPT, for helping me come up with this thing. Um, and right now it just has a library of courses. You'll see here, each of the courses are available as part of the all access membership. Um, so they have this warning here. And then if people don't have it yet, they can go right to check out purchase the membership level and then gain all of the access to all the courses. So for this, I'm going to start, I'm going to put everything on sale. I don't know what sale amount. We'll just do like a hundred dollars off. We'll make it 247 for the first year. So the first thing we want to do is set up that discount code. Here I am in membership settings, paid memberships pro. I'm going to create a discount code. I will call it uh, back to school. How about that? That's kind of cute. And then you set this, the coupon start and end date. This is not the same as when the sale will automatically start in your site. This is just when the coupon is valid. So you can set it to, I like to set it a day before and a day after the sale ends, just in case you're doing like email marketing and sending that coupon out to people all over the world. You just don't know what time zone they're in and when the discount code is going to become unavailable. So I really like that tip to add an extra day on either side. So what is today? Today is the 30th. We'll make it start today and then we'll make it end on August 6th of this year. Cool. And we'll add it to the all access level. I'm going to make the initial payment 247 and let's just make it a lifetime uh, coupon. We don't always do this when we're running sales, but let's make this a super juicy sale for back to school. So I'm knocking $100 off the price of membership. So that's our discount code. Now we're going to go over to site-wide sales. So this is the plugin I want to show you. I don't have it licensed right now. I can do that, but no big deal. So we're going to add a sale. We're going to call this back to school 2023. And we'll make the sale valid from, we'll do today so that we can test it for you. Um, and then we'll run it through August 5th. We'll do one fewer day. The sale type is a paid memberships pro sale. And the discount code is back to school. We're going to always apply the discount automatically. This way people won't email you and say, oh, I forgot to enter the discount code. I wanted to save that amount. It's going to handle that for you. Automatically apply it to all the checkouts during the sale period. We're going to add a banner. I'm going to use a reusable block banner. Save settings and we'll generate a new reusable block for this. I'm going to put it on the bottom right corner of the site. We're going to close until new session. That means that when people dismiss the banner, it won't pop back up every page load. That's your choice how you want to handle that. I'm going to hide the banner on the checkout page. And also for people that are already members of this level. So this is a really cool part of site-wide sales. It helps you hide the sale from existing logged in members. Uh, did you ever have a member see that you were running a promotion and ask to have their full price membership discounted or partially refunded? So this is the way you can protect yourself a little bit from that happening. As long as the user is logged into the membership site and their membership is active, it will not reveal the fact that there's a site-wide flash sale going on. So really important. Um, and smart thing to do. I'm not going to create a landing page for the sale. I'm just going to link right to the checkout page. We've been doing that more with Paid Memberships Pro. We use this product to run all of our sales and we haven't been using a landing page as much. We've just been going right to our, our pricing page or right to our checkout page for our sales. So I saved the settings. I set the sale as active. So let's edit our banner and just make sure it looks cute and we like it for the sale. So I'm going to use, let's see, this is a full site editing theme. I'm going to make this background and our text can be our contrast color. We'll call it the back to school sale. Uh, $100 off all membership, all access membership for the life of your subscription. 
lock in your savings now. Sound good? And then the link, uh, we're going to link this right to our price, our checkout page. So we'll just pull that up, the membership checkout page. Cool. So that's our banner. And our sale is active. So let's check it out. Let's go to the front of our site. So now we have a banner active here. Back to school sale, $100 off all access membership for the life of your subscription. Lock in your savings now. So this will persist until I close it. When I'm browsing the site, I'm browsing the courses. When I click to join from this link or from the banner, I'll use this link here so you can see, it automatically applies the discount code back to school at checkout. It's adjusted my price to $247 per year. And I can check out and I get automatically enrolled in all those courses. So that's pretty exciting. Look at all that I got after my membership. It shows that I have an all access membership. I'm paying this reduced fee. And then we can also view our invoices and see that we were billed $247. Um, and now when I go into a course, I can start taking the course. So that's Paid Memberships Pro, Courses Integration, Lifter LMS, and Sitewide Sales. It's a great way to run a flash sale on your e-learning site for a fixed period of time without having to sit and babysit the sale and turn it on and see what's going on. So we made a checkout. Let's just check out those uh, reports in the admin, uh, what you're going to get and how you're going to be able to analyze how your sale is performing. Sitewide Sales shows you how many people have seen your banner, one, me. And how many people have visited the landing page? We're not using a landing page for this sale, so that would be zero for this sale. How many people did a checkout using that coupon code and how much sale revenue you've made? Um, it shows you a, a report with a calendar of all the days of your sale, highlights the best day of the sale, and then shows you a breakdown of the revenue you've made. Other renewals within that period, you know, people have bought on other days, so it shows you the revenue in your period and it reports on the breakdown. So really cool way to uh, think about doing this. If you're thinking about a Black Friday sale, I strongly suggest you to run a sale first. Run a sale in September, call it back to school. You have enough time to set that up and work out the kinks and work out how you like having the sale set up so that when Black Friday comes around, you're not really freaking out. You're able to enjoy yourself, enjoy the holiday season and enjoy all that bonus revenue that you're making by having a promotion. I'm gonna put a link in the comments or in the description to an article I wrote about discounts and online course sites, different types of discounts you can consider running different types of retention strategies and add-on things you can offer to your existing course students if you want to use a sale to bump the average order value of all of the people shopping in your site. I'm Kim Coleman. This is Sitewide Sales. It's a plugin for WordPress sites to run flash sales. It works with WooCommerce, Paid Memberships Pro, and Easy Digital Downloads. All of the functionality here would work for those three checkout environments. So thank you so much. Like and subscribe if you want to see more content like this.